soldiers from the Royal Regiment of Scotland. Marching proudly, with bayonets fixed. Exercising their freedom of Dumfries by parading through the streets. But why are freedom marches like this important to the military? So much of what we do is behind closed doors or overseas where the public can't necessarily see what we're doing or can necessarily sometimes uh, appreciate some of the work that the guys are doing. But today's like this are really important for the regiment because we get to come back, we get to stroll through the streets with a bit of pomp and circumstance and show the nation and the people of Dumfries what the Royal Regiment of Scotland are all about. The soldiers really enjoy it. A lot of the stuff, we put a lot of effort into the kit preparation and the drill that goes into these things, so sometimes seeing the fruits of their labours with the civilian population of the town enjoying it, we really appreciate it. And the good weather helped with a pretty good turnout for the parade as people lined the streets to catch a glimpse of the spectacle. and show their appreciation for what these soldiers do. It's wonderful that the people of Dumfries can see the regiment marching through. It's remember how these brave men did it, what they did. I think it's very important to keep the army um, in the eye, in our eyes, to realise that what all these young men, what they've done. And for the soldiers themselves, Marching through the communities they are from and serve is important. It makes it very emotional and it gives you an extra spring in your step. But it's good for, for what we do all year round and it's good for the, the, the public to see uh, what we're doing. It's, it, it's, it's very emotional, it's good, very, very good. It's a busy time for the Royal Regiment of Scotland with a series of marches coming up throughout the country. Parades like this are a sign of the mutual respect between the regiment and the communities they're based in and serve, bringing them together to strengthen the bonds between the military and civilian community. David Civils McCann, Forces News, Dumfries. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe to our channel.